Hi, this is Gina with GinasCraftingSpot.com. I wanted to show you today a card that I had made for my card making class. Um, this is how they got it. It was for like a very, very beginner class that I held at the local community center. And I had all the, um, all the pieces to the card in these baggies. So that way, you know, they had everything and just watched me and we could put it together. Um, put the card together you know, while they watched me and saw what I was doing because they were, they, they didn't know how to stamp. They didn't, really didn't know anything about card making. So it was really fun. But anyway, this is a make and take. And I, for the supplies, I took an eight and a half by 11 sheet of craft card stock and cut it in half the long way. So at the eight inch mark, so it was a four. Yeah, my eight and a half by 11 sheet of paper. And I, um, cut it at four and a quarter and then I scored it in the middle so here we have our portrait card and then what I have is a piece and again I made this super duper simple so they could just pretty much attach it and you know see how pretty and fun a simple card could be just with some pattern paper and solid card stock and you know just a sentiment um, so that's why it's so simple but anyway, so this is four by five and a quarter. So I just, we just attach this to the card base. And I'm not adding ribbon or anything fancy. This was just like to show how you could make a card with the least amount of supplies pretty much until, you know, they were sure that they liked it. And there was a few people who wanted to learn more. So I'm probably gonna have an advanced class hopefully for them. So I'm just taking some, what is this, uh, chestnut roan, oh, one of these little ink pads, it's all coming apart. And there's I had inked up previously, not that it really matters, can't really see too much, but I know it's there. So I'm just going to go ahead and attach these and this pattern paper is graphic 45 paper I had gotten at Tuesday morning I think and it was in a bulk pack with you know like I don't know 25 50 sheets of this exact design so it was perfect for this card I could make I think I made like 10 for all the people who came which was awesome and then instead of ribbon I just cut a little piece of this black cardstock and it's half inch by four. So I'm just going to go ahead and attach that. And um, three and three quarters by five is what this other piece of the pattern paper was. I just turn it. And I'm just going to position it wherever I want. I guess it's more, it's closer to three and three quarters long ways. So we have that. And then I have this sentiment that I had pre-stamped. Um, and it's from a Close to My Heart set. I love all their sentiment stamps. They're so pretty. Alright, and what I'm going to do is layer this on top of this. And what I did show them was just how to cut the cardstock and make a little banner shape. So let me cut a little bit of this off and then just cut in the middle and up each side. And you have your little banner. We'll attach it to there. Let me attach it first, then I'll do the other banner. And then I did give them um, a couple of little rhinestones to add as well. I'll just cut this a little bit. mirror that. 
then I'll just pop it up. Probably just on here on the bottom. And this is just some homemade fun foam that I used for the class. A thin one. Just put it right here. And then on the inside, I just cut them a piece of um, cream color cardstock. I think three and three quarters by five. Like it right there, greeting in there. That is it. I gave them some bling, so I'll just use a piece of this. And it's a really simple card, but I mean, they all loved it. They were amazed at, you know, how they were able to put it together. It was cute. I remember those days not knowing how to. You know, we'll put a card together. So I'll just put some here. And that just dresses it up a little bit. And that is it. That was my easy, simple card that they loved making. And um, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.